Early season skirmishes maybe, but still a sense of occasion. And one here that will tell us a lot about the mood of both clubs. Immediate prospects and looking forward, serious chances of silverware to Brighton North London trophy cabinets. And Mauricio Pochettino has named a side that suggests serious intent. Five changes from the weekend with Son only on the bench and Harry Kane still searching for a first club goal since the 24th of May. Arsenal make ten changes, pretty much as predicted, with only Aaron Ramsey remaining from the Chelsea capitulation. It's a strong side, though, a seasoned international feel rather than the academy one of previous years. There's a first start for the largely forgotten Joel Campbell since the FA Cup third round in January. Arsenal trying to spread the play here. Managed to stretch this Spurs back line at all, but that's better. And here comes the cross towards Giroud, and it's Campbell! Just wouldn't sit down for him. But you still feel that he might have done better, but maybe the real chance was for Giroud at the near post. To space now for Ramsey. It's a good touch towards Campbell. It's an important intervention, although not a convincing one by Vimmer. Now Oxlade-Chamberlain. Chance for him to shoot. Really good save. But on the follow-up, it's Mathieu Flamini. This competition used to be about Arsenal's youngsters, but the old man of the midfield has given them the lead. It was given away and Spurs never recovered. Oxlade-Chamberlain shot, only palmed out by Vorm, who might have done better. And it's a good finish from Flamini once again in this competition. It's Arsenal who are holding sway. Felt like the Mathieu Flamini of ten years ago, that. On the prowl, on the poach, and good neat finish. Now Kane, Eriksen have made a great run. Kane instead looks here for Danny Rose, promising, really promising. Well, he switched it onto his right foot. And didn't have the control and composure that he would have done on the other side. Forward by Fazio. Rose trying to get him behind, he's done so brilliantly. Goalkeeper has come. Big appeals for the penalty, but only from the fans. Behind for a goal kick. Big misjudgment there from Debushi. But Ospina got out swiftly. Forward by Oxlade Chamberlain. Giroud has continued his run. Ramsey and Campbell available. So too Oxlade Chamberlain. He's aimed it for Campbell. And that is athletic and acrobatic by Danny Rose, and then very clumsy indeed from Flamini. Yeah, no option at all. Lively half then for him. That was the foul, and the inevitable yellow. It was good from Giroud. Excellent defending from Rose. Campbell's OK, thankfully. Now it's Ericsson to... Run it away, it was Ramsey who gave it away. Here's Kane. Scintillating counter here from Spurs. And fired just wide from Harry Kane. I think he's entitled to go for it from there. Ericsson. Here's Kane. And Chadley, a nice rhythm about Spurs at the start of this second half. Chadley to check inside, Ericsson to hit it. Touched on to the post! Kane denied. We'll take another look. Dave Bryan was short. And he's right to be. Good finish, though. Well, the way they've started this second half has got the crowd going. There's Townsend. In from Trippier. Going to travel a long way here for Nasser Chadley. In again towards Kane! <laughs> Chambers stuck out his foot. Spurs are level, thanks to an own goal. Chadley gets the credit. Kane should get some too for being there. It was sloppy from Arsenal. It wasn't unlike their goal. It was given away in a similar area. 
And Chadley with a swivel of the hips. And Callum Chambers with a fatal diversion. Now we have a cup tie. And once again, his team showing real vulnerability. Now Dyer. And he got in behind and didn't really know what to do. Townsend's corner, he's got free at the far post, off the line. And Kieran Gibbs just, just stopped it going over the line. Here's the conclusive proof. My goodness me, another millimetre and it's a goal. 20 left, game is stretched. Here comes Oxlade-Chamberlain. Now Ramsey, cleverly rolled for Giroud. That's a really good save from Vaughan. Tried to go narrow side of the goalkeeper here, Olivier Giroud. Vaughan stretched out a leg. Sanchez just overbalancing there. Getting a second chance, though. Well, it might fall kindly for Flamini! Who scores his second goal? Sweet, sweet hit from Mathieu Flamini. Sweet, sweet moment for the travelling fans at Arsenal. Back in front. It looped up invitingly, but on the run, on the volley. It is technically brilliant. And it's Flamini's night at the lane. A goal to remember. And Pochettino may be about to suffer his first defeat in a North London derby. Still there's a chance for Spurs. Carroll stabs it in. Mertesacker wins it. Clinton G. It might yet turn into a cross, but Son is dispossessed. Giroud wins the little header. And now it's Ramsey. And it's Arsenal looking for icing on the cake late on. Now it's Theo Walcott. It's Walcott! And he drags it wide. People wondered about Arsenal's steal before tonight, but they've shown it in abundance, embodied by that man, Mathieu Flamini. Arsenal's poor run is over. This is a big victory inspired by a loyal servant, and it finishes at White Hart Lane. Tottenham Hotspur 1, Arsenal 2.